Here we go! Would you date a trans person, honestly? Think about it for a second. Well, if you said no, I'm sorry, but that's pretty discriminatory. <laughs> Nope, not this time. Actually, we don't want to date a transgender person. You psycho! Next slide. Ex-transgender man now wants to live as sexless alien and has nipples removed. Nope. Mm -mm. Nope, not gonna do it. Not good. Nope. You look like the princess in Zelda decided to go to college and experiment with her friends. You look like the glitter people from Twilight had an encounter with a unicorn. You look like the stepchild that your step troll dad doesn't like. What is wrong with nipples? John Hickenlooper announces 2020 presidential campaign. Nothing screams national respect or admiration much like President Hickenlooper. Married lesbian couple are now husband and wife. Still a lesbian couple. Literally have not changed What's going on guys? So right now we've got a legitimate debate starting on whether we should lower the voting age to 16 to give the Democrats some kind of a chance in the 2020 election. Huh. Let me think about that for a second, Cotton. Um, when I was 16, I still thought that there was a reasonable chance I could figure out a way to become Batman. When I was 16, I literally put a quote in my yearbook saying I was going to be a rock star. Do you see what I'm saying? Now we've got he being she and she being them and Z and Y and 897,000 pronouns and sexless, nipless alien boy running around. The current adults voted in AOC to Congress and she could possibly be the dumbest person ever. And you want 16 year olds to decide who the potential leader of the free world is? You really want them to vote? So, in the news today, CNN is getting sued by Covington High School kids for defamation suit and targeting them for wearing Make America Great Again hats. Dear CNN, dear CNN, I mean this with the utmost sincerity and respect. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out that there is a price to pay for fake news after all. CNN, how much money does it cost to report fake news? Um, about $250 million. Million dollars? Million dollars. I hope they take you to the cleaner so bad. You are a horrible news organization. You are everything wrong with the media. You are the enemy of the people. And I hope they take you to the cleaner so bad that you get renamed Covington News Network. In fact, kind of got a ring to it. Much better than Communist News Network, because that's exactly what What's you are. What's going on in the news today? House votes in favor of illegal immigrant voting. What the? Non-American citizens voting in American elections. Non-American citizens. Non-American. Nothing screams America, much like allowing non-American citizens to vote for American elections. Oh. What kind of backwards paradox of stupid do we live in the same people that for two years have gone after Donald Trump for allegedly working with foreign entities to rig the 2016 election have now voted to allow illegals to vote in elections? Don't make no sense. Isn't that the same thing as foreign interference? Where's Ashton? This has to be 